some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we find ourselves somewhere in Denver, Colorado, with the one and only Regan Benson. And she's very much upset that a male officer has to, to use the metal detecting wand on her person. But you know, Regan, this is the kind of thing you expect out of her, except when it comes to a bow Denver Metro audits, if you get my drift. So, sit back, relax, and enjoy the show! No, I was going to make sure that pepper spray in the kind of way. Okay. I'll take your first two, if you don't Thank you. Um, you won't be able to go into the courtroom with the water, with the bottles here, but you can leave them here on the table if you want. I medically need water. Right. <laughs> uh, we'll oh, yeah, oh, get the permission from the, from somebody else then, okay? Okay, because I literally can pass out if I do not have okay. water. Okay, go ahead and take it in with you then. Thank you. Just saying. Look, I get it. Everybody's just doing their job, but it's not appropriate for men to be wanting women. When she passed through the metal detector, something set it off, so the security guard has to use the wand on her, but she's of the belief that a man shouldn't be doing that to a woman. I mean, come on, the wand doesn't even make physical contact with anybody. Kind of makes me wonder if this is a subtle way for her to protest the so-called violation of the Fourth Amendment. I mean, frauditors do make that argument all the time. Ma'am, I'm sorry, was there a problem? Is there an issue? Well, not now. I mean, it was. My, my issue is the wand. Okay, that's part of the courtroom security. Yeah, I get that. But I find it inappropriate that men wand women. Okay, well, you stop putting his hands on you, and it is completely appropriate. No, yeah. it's not. Okay. You should have a woman. Okay, well, then you need to take it up with the judge. Oh, do I? Yes, sir. Oh, really? So you came over here, what, to get confrontational with me over that? It's simply no, not you appropriate. I was confrontational? Okay. I was confrontational? The security person. Was I confrontational? Are you? You're not serious right now, right? You're not serious right now. You're not serious. Confrontational? Of course she had some confrontation over there. But you haven't seen her confrontational until you check out this video in the description or in the corner up there. Take a look at it because I had to censor so much of that video. In fact, it was so bad that one of my commenters said that it sounded like a robot talking. Co confrontational? Confrontational. If you have a problem with the security procedures, just report I simply to told him Sorry. that wanding women, men wanding women is inappropriate. So don't come You're over complaining. here and get up in my face and try to get confrontational with me. Okay? We'll so why don't you here. turn around and go back where you came from? Oh, I'm right here. Well, I don't like you right here, and I didn't ask you to come over here. So, is there anything else you needed? No. Then turn around and go about your I'm way. I'm not going to turn around and go away. Well, I guess I neither am I then. You want to have an argument? We'll have an argument. You want to have an argument? We'll have an argument. Well, I know that's not exclusive to women because I've had to deal with that with an acquaintance of mine who has no driver's license and asked me if I could drive him to the store so he could go grocery shopping. But after criticizing my driving and threatening to kick my ass, I just left him on the side of the road. He never did that again. I wonder if anybody's done that to her because of her loud mouth. If not, then they should. It may straighten her up. Am I being ridiculous? No, I think you were being ridiculous, and now you're getting your ass called out. So now you want to keep going. You don't know when to shut the fuck up. Turn that fucking body cam on. I am not afraid of your fucking body cam. All right. I simply asked you if you had a problem with And I told you what my fucking problem was. You want to keep going? Because I can have a long list of fucking problems. Again, I told you where you take it up. And I told you where you could fucking go. Oh boy, such a foul mouth on you. Still nowhere near as bad as that one time you confronted that cop over nothing. Like I said, the video will be in the description. Just in case you want to see it, because it is bad. Have a nice day. You too. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
Well, I'll tell you something. With her attitude, I wouldn't want her as a friend, lover, or wife, or even a co-worker.